hoping to see all of you at our grand opening on May 1st. I want to give you a small taste of just what you'll be seeing. I'm very pleased today to introduce to you my gallery director, Robert Little, who has uh, agreed to come here today and describe to you what he enjoys in a few of my paintings. Robert? Thanks, Robert, for coming today. I appreciate it. Good morning. Good morning. Look forward to Good what to you see have you, Darryl. offer with us. Thanks. This is um, one of Daryl's recent works, which um, I think is a very interesting and it says an awful lot about the skill and painting that he has. Most of this is probably, from what I can observe, a palette knife painting. Uh, very strong in its color, very strong in its shapes, uh, in line. Um, relationships and uh, the and, and, and it, there's a real story to this that comes out as you as you begin to look at it there's in the application of the paint it's extremely fluid and if when you first look at this painting it looks rectilinear and form and understandable but when you get closer to it and you see how fluid the application of the paint is here I find that absolutely fascinating I think that's really a great great aspect <clears throat> I would like to describe another painting which is quite different than this, but has a lot of the same characteristic. You would, when I show it to you, you will react differently to it because it feels much looser and immerses you in the story very quickly, as this one actually does, but in a very different way. So, so this is all about fun and experience, and this immerses you in that uh, feeling very, very quickly. The other painting... Uh, would be more about form and the narrative would be about work and structure. This is totally fluid and free and one of the strongest components of this, in my opinion, is the curved horizon because it's creating a space very quickly which is all in motion of the water and then pierced by this line of the female body coming down into the shadow down here. So you've got these wonderful play of these forms and shapes in here as well, very subtly because the colors are much lighter, uh, softer than the strength in the other painting. But the strength of this is the softness in the form and then almost a silhouette of the lady in the painting, uh, the bather in the painting here, but there's an awful lot of form in her as well when you really look at this. Um, it's just, to me, this is a great painting with a, a lot of fun and enjoyment. And if I were up here with the palette knife, I think I'd almost be doing a dance and listening to music doing this because it just brings that into my soul as I look at this. I think it's very, very well done. Thank you, Robert. I really appreciate those comments you made here. A good art critic and a good friend. Thanks so much for coming <laughs> oh, no, here those today. are just opinions right from the heart, and I react the way I react to paintings, and I think everybody reacts to paintings in different ways. So.